testing out our brand new tank. What tank? This tank. Oh, whoa, whoa! You broke my window! no use owning a tank if the gun doesn't work right because then it's just a tractor at that point. So I was getting a lot of hate that the, oh okay, yeah the gun is actually plugged so nothing can go in there out of it. Um, so unfortunately it's just yet. We're good man, solid pass through on the whole barrel. No I think there's probably a plug in here. I can see you really well. Oh wait I can see you too. See the difference between my tank and a tank that's deactivated is that mine isn't deactivated. Oh, well, I think it was illegal. So let's just find it. Oh, this will fit. So I bought this in case we couldn't do that legally. I think that's twice as illegal. If this is illegal and this is illegal, it cancels out. Yeah. I'm just gonna stand behind this and then we'll get it lined up. All right. There's a Fed here. Which one? All of them? This is your tank? Yeah, I just picked it up. We're just working on the gun. For ATF guideline 69-2420, it's actually illegal to have a tank with a functioning gun on it. Well, I have the registration for it. It's for a 2001 Honda Civic. I think it's a little clean still. We're gonna add some character to it. We'll like rub some dirt on it. If I cannot drive through a cinder block wall with my daily driver, why did I buy that? So we have an 11 foot tall brick wall and I laid this all by hand with one hand. You paid someone $13,000 to do that. Also, we're gonna drive through this car. I wanna make sure school buses are safe. I'm a little concerned about the- Like it's extreme size? No, the kids that are sitting in aisle nine. Can I speak to the owner? He's not here right now. He's down over the hill. I can't hear you. Take I him said he's, he's Take down, him. Excuse me. Can I speak to Who's this guy? I would assume you could park in a parking lot and be fine. Oh, sh you can see it right on there. Oh, sh occupational oh, safety and health administration. Yeah, so we're gonna have a look around, and make sure everything's nice and safe, and y'all use all the proper precautions and protection. Y'all had any workplace accidents lately? No, I, I I wouldn't say we've had many. So what happened zero days ago? <laughs> I couldn't recall if anything had happened. Oh. All right, listen, we're gonna look over every square inch of this place. See, y'all got some work going on up there, that second level. You don't have a railing on that staircase now. You gotta have one. I don't know why we need a railing. What's well, in case something like that happens? Luckily, it wasn't a person. Okay, uh, oh my God. okay I had no clue about that. Well, at least nothing fell on the person. I would say so that. I've seen enough, to be honest. I gotta get out of here. I'm gonna give you your final report, and then I'm gonna go. Sir, okay, if I, I'm... You ruined my car, I gotta get home somehow. Oh, you can just ride with her, she can take you. <laughs> you want me to ride in that? He's I'm only been in six actions. I don't, here's your report. Right. I appreciate your time. You're gonna hear from our people. Like a good way? Just be on the lookout. Thanks! So until my class three weapons license comes in, this is how the pioneers used to do it back in the old days.
I just want to take a moment here to address the false allegations that everyone's making about me illegally moving my property line 11 foot four and a half inches every week. We're just pineapple farmers trying to make an honest living. There's nothing weird about our militarized installation. We don't mind if anyone crosses our property line or anything. So I just want to clear the air because a lot of neighbors were concerned that we were illegally moving the fence line so that we could illegally gain private property and make it ours. I have more tanks than the following countries. Indonesia at zero. Russia. Russia? They only have 1.0000 tanks. That's a million tanks. I have more tanks in this country, Pakistan. They only have 1.0000 tanks. That's a hundred thousand. You're talking about Pakistan. This also gives me legal power beyond what most other civilians would have. I, I bought this tank from the United Kingdom. I went over there as a, a, a law-abiding citizen. I got a speeding ticket. They caught me doing six miles an hour over. They have speed cameras everywhere. Now, I did not know this, so I was speeding everywhere I went. We have photographic evidence that shows a, a red Toyota uh, Hilux. All they have is a photo of me driving. You so. just admitted to it on camera. <gasps> no. Look, it's just a piece of paper. If they want me, they're gonna have to bring a lot more than that. So I'm thinking, I had this theory, if I could just get a little more money, like $800 trillion, I could buy New York City and level it. They can. You parks there. No, I buy all the real estate. Empire State Building, mine. Twin Towers, mine. No, they don't. The White House, mine. That's mine. not in New York. But I'm saying. Ever since I was six weeks old, I wanted to pull tug of war, my tank versus my world's largest monster truck. As you know, we have remote control of the truck. Wow, okay, that's a little bit more torque than I thought. Oh, Monty Max is a useless piece of crap, dude. Why is it pulling a fing tank? That was fun. I just hope we didn't mess up the grass too much.